Abe. He is sitting with Manny. Uh, we're showcasing one of his artworks, and this is our first ever video uh, segment of art. Uh, our goal is pretty much to uh, showcase new art, showcase new talent. We're always going to have new people. You're always going to see new faces here with us. And uh, our mission is to hopefully inspire our viewers, uh, whether it be with art or simply change their way of thinking in any aspect. Uh, today we're showcasing, as I said, uh, one of Manny's pieces. Uh, it's called... Well, this one is... Uh Put it together inside memories. Put it together inside memories. Eureka. So why did you name it that? Why why is it that uh, why is it that you chose this kind of raw and uh, colorful and explosive uh, imagery to well, well what are you what's your goal with this painting? What's your goal with this art? I really think that, that my work uh, is uh, almost like a Ouija board. I start to work on it, I get an impulse, I get a feeling. There seems to be some impetus. And then I realize that something is talking through me, like a medium. And I started, as I do the work, it starts uh, developing. And um, I started laying down these pictures, and it, start, it started to make me think about how in the mind the memories must lay like this. Uh, you know, scattered. That, yeah, memories don't necessarily take uh, this orderly form in our brain like a deck of cards, since there was cards. And then his childhood memories. You can see the Archie's here. And this is an old Archie's book. And anyway, uh, once I saw the work and the colors, you know, colors speak to you. It's almost like la a language. You, know, you may not know someone's language, but anybody can understand a pattern of color. And if you see the movie, um, Close Encounters of the Third Kind, they spoke through music and color. So, I'll make a long story short, when all this was laid out, I said to myself, that's like the neurons of the brain, the synapses, and how they transmit uh, the neurons and the protons and, and uh, the things that give us messages in the brain, through the synapses. So and what what message are you trying to portray? With this? Well, really, what, what are you trying to give out? It wasn't a message. It's almost what it was trying to tell me because I think the work actually speaks to me. So it's almost like an analysis of something. You're trying to yeah, describe I, something in an unorthodox way. It's like it's like a divination, almost like a Yoruba or a, What's a Yoruba. The technique of the Africans, where they they beseech a higher force, and as I'm working, it speaks to me. It reveals something. And what it told me was, put it together. Inside memories will give you Eureka. And when we want to find out what is it that we need to know, uh, just look inside your memories, organize them in different patterns, and sooner or later something will click. And um, I really think that a lot of my work, I've been told, mimics the patterns of nature. If you look at slides, um, or... What, what's clicking in this picture? Is this picture supposed to click, or is it... I see, see, the if, you look, if you look here, I have some Dutch elders, so like the establishment, what has come before, and then the money, and then the, the cards, fate, establishment, economics, um, sexuality, a beautiful woman, a dream, trophy wife or woman, and here's like a moon figure, and these are all the connections, an ever watchful eye, how we're scrutinized, and all these things firing and compiling. And I just think the work is just an incredible piece of work. I think that it would be compliment any serious collector. I was friends with Basquiat, I was friends with Andy Warhol, um, and uh, Keith Haring, and I think that I, I carry the torch of these great artists, and I, unfortunately they died. And I'm still here. I don't know if that's fortunate or unfortunate. Of course it's fortunate. You're bringing the talent. Bringing the I don't know how much longer I'll be here, but the work will remain. <laughs> and uh, I wish somebody that would out there who can value my, my journey and uh, great people like Abe who bring it together, future actor and uh, talented uh, uh, arts uh, savant. Uh, I really feel that you should add this to your collection. They're for sale. Uh, all monies go to buy more supplies for art. 
so that I can get this connection with a higher force. And uh, if you like uh, outsider art, Art Brut, um, Jean de Buffet, this carries in the tradition of fine art classical. So there we go. The piece is called Put It Together Inside Memories. Eureka. Eureka. And remember, I am Saint M.A. And, Saint M.A. And uh, M.A. is like Albrecht Drewer. Uh, I, I just I love the initials. Why I really go on about who I am. I really would like the work to outlive me. And it does. It certainly does. And it will. Thank you. And it's a labor of love because uh, I work under the most um, pure conditions. Some would say harsh conditions. And I use, um, but yet the, the work has shown great appeal. And uh, as I say, collectors own it. And I wish you to own it, and I want to do more work. I have a very big collection. There we have it, a one-of-a-kind piece. And of